Ladies and gents, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Over Potato. I am joined by my fellow spelunking buddies. And for the king today, I am joined by uh, by Rhapsody and Rito of Retromation. How's it going, chaps? We'll start. We'll we'll start. Oh, we'll I was going to do this. Okay, cool. I'm doing so nope. good. I'm doing nope. so good, but I'd do so much better if I knew how Rhapsody was doing. Okay. I am afraid that how I feel is contingent upon how you feel. So we've just entered an awful loop. I, uh, I think we just got stuck in time. <laughs> we broke the fabric of reality. Oh no. I can see into different dimensions, like in every single time this has been represented in a cartoon where you're just slipping through the time stream and you can just see all of these clocks just hanging out in what appears to be a large waterfall. Wild. Sorry, so many waterfall. clocks, dude. So in many clocks. Waterfall? Clocks? Waterfall? Clocks. A waterfall? Yeah, clocks. it kind of looks like they're like flying through a waterfall when they're flying through the time yeah. stream in literally every cartoon. Have you... Did you not watch many cartoons growing up, Orbital? No, I didn't really. What'd you watch? The Seven Nightly News? <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah, sure that's... Yeah, oh, yeah, that, oh, that one close to the bone, that one. Uh, <laughs> no, I just didn't watch cartoons. I don't know, you, cartoons didn't exist when I was a kid, you know? Cartoons didn't <laughs> exist when you were a kid? I know for a fact that's wrong. No, I just, I just have not seen many cartoons in general. I think we are stuck in time, Rhapsody. <laughs> I think I'm Orbital so might be from the 1880s. What has happened uh, did here? Did we go back? Did our emotional dependence teleport us back to the 1890? We did it. Uh, we finally it. went back. Back to the past. Nothing, nothing non copyright infringing. Quite, nothing does it for me quite like Punch and Judy. That's the only, that's <laughs> the only cartoonified uh, <laughs> program that I'll watch. You know me, I go for a little bit of uh, the Mountebank Commedia dell'arte. I love me some Minicello. Ooh. What is a death mark? <laughs> oh. I think it just means that you'll receive fatal damage after a while. Um, Does it uh, stay with me after combat? I believe it mm. might not. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's <laughs> reassuring. <laughs> no, it's oh, gone. No. Okay, good. <laughs> You have five minutes to live, I think. Mm. Maybe. Five minutes or 50 years. I'm not certain. It's one or the other. You have you have five to live. <laughs> five something. How long does this snail sleep for? Three. Depends on the snail. Three. It sleeps <laughs> for three. Depends on the... S what? That is the only wrong answer. <laughs> <laughs> Define snail. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a slug that's invested and got its first homeowner's grant. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right. All right, Rito, I've got a question for you. Uh -oh. I've got a question for you. And okay. uh, I know Rhapsody's answer to this already, uh, but okay. I feel that we need to flesh this out. What do you think about New Year's resolutions? Uh, I mean, I think it's a convenient time to organize your life but not that much more convenient than say like the start of a month even mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i don't know i mm -hmm. i don't really i don't really do them you don't do new new year's resolutions not really like I'll, maybe like a week later i'll scrape together a list of new year's i'd like tis <laughs> but <laughs> that's about it All right. that's about it so i i don't i don't I think it's stupid to be into it, but I think that if that's the only time you're willing to do it, you got a problem. That should be your New Year's I'd like to. Mm. I, I think like the, the same problem I have with New Year's resolutions is relevant to the discussion of motivation versus discipline. Uh, in that like a lot of people will sit around and just wait for the right, the optimal moment. We'll call that a New Year's for a New Year's resolution uh, or when motivation strikes. And it's just like such better practice to just do things <laughs> like independently <laughs> of that. Yeah, I, I miss making my, my resolutions on the first. I guess I'll just wait until next year. My New Year's resolution <laughs> is to make New Year's resolutions next year. <laughs> okay. 
my new my new year's resolution is to be less emotionally uh, supported by New Year's resolutions. Hey, not how bad. Uh, there's actually two weapons here that are probably quite relevant to our party. So there's the uh, Lightning Lance, which has 17 physical damage. Yes, that's probably a downgrade from what you're currently holding orbital, but the moveset is actually what's really important. Uh, it has Shock Thrust, Lightning Strike, and Defensive Stance. Shock Thrust gives shock to a target, which locks out one of their die. Lightning Strike does the same and ignores armor, and Defensive Stance just boosts your own armor. Uh, other than that, we also have a Winter Spear here, which five rolls on Awareness for 22 physical damage, has Icy Thrust, Heavy Thrust, and Frost Spin uh, for a single target hit, a larger single target hit, and an AoE hit. It also applies Freeze on all of those. Uh, but for Rito, we have the Fire Sword, 28 physical damage, uh, is a one-handed sword, rolls four times on strength, and has Flaming Lunge, which is just a giant amount of damage to a single target, as well as igniting them, and Slash, which is a bleed. Ooh. Wait, were any of those piercing? Like, uh, I feel no. Like that might be something we should care about. I mean, it sounds good. My Cursed Sword does 20 physical damage on three rolls. Mm. I don't know. But it's breakable. Not that I see it breaking anytime soon. Save Ryan, well, but uh, that, that fire sword has some nice serious have. damage up on what you currently are using. I'd, I'd like to have it. I like the sound of a fire sword. Is it expensive? Um, It's one, 165. Uh, Orbital. If it's not expensive, I don't want it. Oh, I, okay, fair enough. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm, currently, I'm currently rocking with the 24 physical damage war scythe. Mm -hmm. What are the rolls for the two weapons that you mentioned in the shop? So the Lightning Lance rolls four times on the shock uh, for a single target. Uh -huh. Rolls four times on the uh, the ignoring armor single target. And two yeah. times to defend itself. And then the Winter uh -huh. Spear rolls five times on all of its different things. Okay. I mean, I th I'm currently rocking out with a War Scythe, which does 24 physical damage. I feel that that's kind of... I feel that's a big enough damage... Uh, difference to warrant keeping the war scythe at least for now i mean it the might war be nice scythe... to have something that ignores armor though since mm. i don't i don't know it might yeah, be worth considering exactly. and the lightning yeah. the lightning lance ignores armor while shocking a target as that well as has really plus three armor on it and plus 25 percent damage against ice if, is it is it breakable it's nope. it's, it's not breakable is it okay not all. all right if you feel if you feel it's best um go for it I'm uh, quite happy to, to rock out with a lightning lance yep. or whatever. It's also worth noting it's one-handed, so you can just put a shield on as well. Ah, oh, that's kind of fun. Yeah. I, Rito, do you have a spare shield going by any chance? Or, uh... I'm pretty sure I do. Oh, would I, be able to, would I be able to borrow it, if at all possible? I think I can arrange that. Sturdy iron shield, five armor, three resistance. That would be... Absolutely spot on. I'd I very will give much it to like you when I can. Okay. I'm just quickly selling off a bunch of things here because I do need a little bit more before I can pick up that fire sword. This is what I do for my party. I appreciate it. Does anyone want to become a pirate? I feel that this is. Still oh, yeah. A we, did, we never answered that. Yeah. Who wants to become a pirate? Which like everyone. stereotypical pirate feature would you most want? Like peg leg, parrot, eye oh, patch, syphilis. Like what, syphilis. what would be your defining character? Sorry, what? Sorry, is a parrot is a parrot a defining characteristic of a pirate now? Yeah, like, it can be. parrot on the shoulder. I'm like, like yeah, if if this was a cartoon, not that you would understand orbital. If this was a cartoon yeah. and all the characters were defined by one feature, it'd be like that one has a parrot. Yeah, that one has right. a peg leg. Yeah, but like, okay, so if you see like a feature in isolation, like a parrot in isolation, you're not immediately going to think pirate. Where's this pirate? Yeah. <laughs> <Where's> the pirate? <laughs> I went to like, the zoo and I was, I went to the pirate exhibit. Like eye patch. <laughs> All the pirates were invisible. Them. Peg leg, you know, like. Parrot. <laughs> parrot. I, I just didn't see it. I'll be honest. I'm sorry. Yeah. Um. Alcoholic well, tendencies. I, I forgot these... that you hate animals. I forgot you hate animals. I'm sorry. Mm. I do. 
I do. I, I had a lot of fun facts. People told me a lot of fun facts about animals, by the way. Um, what was your funnest fact about animals that you've learned? I, truthfully, I can't remember them because I don't really like animals and therefore I didn't commit uh, any memory space to remember the fun facts about animals. Oh, gracious work on your behalf. Yeah, <laughs> truly. Uh, what am I doing, Rhapsody? What do I want to do? Uh, you probably basically need to wait for Rito to catch up to us, but Rito should also probably stop at Wenduro and cure Curse. I would like yeah. to. Also, it's worth noting that the um, the bandit camp at the bottom, when Haunt is active, all shops and service prices are increased. Mm -hmm. That's a fun little, fun little bonus for us there. Uh, Rito, if you could also pick up all of the God's Beard in there, that'd be super helpful. Can do. It's all right. Rito is far and away the most agreeable wealthy ad adventurer. Sorry, yeah, agreeable too, actually. <laughs> uh, it's also worth noting, I did just buy Rito a sword. It's true. <laughs> and I'm just giving him some plants. Plants for a fire sword? Sign me up. Yeah, these are some good herbs, dude. These are some good herbs, though, that you bought in uh, Wendero. <laughs> I wouldn't know. I don't partake. Right. What's your favorite herb, Rito? And Rhapsody. Hmm. Oh. That's hard. Probably Herb Kazaz from <laughs> Bojack, Bojack Horseman. I'm, is... uh, I'm pretty fond of Herbie fully loaded. Mm. <laughs> Starring Lindsay Lohan. Eh, no, it was quite good, actually. Uh, Rito, if you want also to pass deal. me the shield... Actually, I think you can pass the shield directly to Orbital now, and you can both change your layouts. Oh, lordy. That was very good, Rito. But in all seriousness, what is it? Like, basil, coriander, thyme? I, I, right now, I'm, I'm, I'm on a dill kick. Oh. A dill kick. <laughs> what? Dill kick. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm only on a small dill kick. I'm on a dill kickle. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Lightning if wise. I had if I had to choose, I I would do a little dill pickle. I would I would pick it. That was oh, where's my groan button? <laughs> there we go. That would get it done. Uh, do you want to change your fire sword? Oh, do I have it? Oh, I didn't. Yeah, I didn't I see the little, the little. I didn't see Are the you... little thing show up. Hold on. Oh. Ooh, it's cool looking. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then... Okay, I'm gonna pop all of that. Come up here. Oh, yeah. Party member's no longer in range. Oh. Wait, no longer in all range right. for what? Is there a thing that I needed I was, to be in range I for? I was just trying to give you the god's beards. I, really... I gave you two out of three. It's okay. It might be good if I have one anyways. Since you got six, I don't think you'll run out soon. Yeah, jeez Louise. Six god's beard. Uh-huh. What are you going to do? Help your friends with those? Uh, <laughs> primarily? No. I'll just save them for when I'm hurt. <laughs> I'm specifically going to wait until I get out of battle before I heal, just so that I don't heal any y'all. Are you planning to come to this Pipesmith Rhapsody? Or, uh... No. I have a fully upgraded pipe already. All right. Is three the max? Yes. Hmm. Ah. Oh. Nice. Okay, there's a lot of um, herbs. There's a lot of good herbs here. It's not uh, not just a pipe. I'll buy three God's beards then. Hell nice. yeah. Uh, I guess I'll just actually buy a bunch of everything. Yeah, could be useful. Why not? I'll buy some scholar's warts to level myself up. Golden roots. There we go. Sure. Uh, chill out here. Yep. Nice. I'm wait for Rito of Retromation. <laughs> That's me. Oh, good lord. The roll. I get fully engulfed by this pile of sand. Just entirely. <laughs> you should just be able to emerge from it with the <laughs> item. I got some some fur boots, so yay. Ah, oh, it's the boots with the fur. Got the whole club looking at her. <laughs> looking at her. <laughs> Did you know that she hit the floor? She hit the floor? Yeah. 
Next thing you know, shot got low, 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 low. low, low, low. Yeah. Um, all right. Uh, how can I get you area. into this battle? Because do you you don't have support range for any reason, do you? Me? No, I don't think. I don't think I get. Oh, I've got a plan. I've got a plan, Rhapsody. I've got a plan. Here's the plan. I'm gonna give you mm -hmm. something that has support range, which yeah, we don't can equip. I, I was thinking yeah, about that, but then if I have to move down, then I have to use an extra focus just to come back up, but I can do that. It's okay. Is I it a big deal if we just wait a turn? Or? Well, it's a big deal if we wait a turn because I can take us into that battle and then take us into the demon cave. Uh, so, And it's also, we would have to wait until your next turn. So it's not a next turn, uh -oh. it's a next round. Yeah. Did you give me the thing with the sport range? No, I'm giving it to you now. Oh, so there, there. Okay, okay. I mean, so they're not—they're not bad, so anyways. I just lose some strength. We're gonna fight Fireboy first. Yep, we have to. I'm gonna fight Great. him with fire too. Ooh. All right. What am I gonna do? This is a, an entirely new world. Okay, I can taunt. This is something I don't really ever want to do. I don't think. Uh, defense. I mean, you oh. do actually have the most armor out of the entire party at this point. That is true. <laughs> I feel like I've done something wrong. Oh, he can't be shocked. Yeah, you could just like look at the immunities, like ever. It would be really helpful for you, I feel. <laughs> I was just more excited about attacking him more than it. <laughs> Should I just it's do a, a taunt? Or, cause he can't, he can't bleed, he can't burn. Just I mean, taunt? people do need to attack, so it's probably just worth attacking at this point because everyone's got the extra armor, so. Yeah. All right. I'll taunt. I can taunt next time. Oh. Uh, I think I've got oh, armor he piercing. He dealt, he dealt eight damage to me just when I attacked him. Yep. Just reflects a how, little bit How much bit does damage. the ref Just a little bit? I think it's eight. I think it's just eight flat. Oh, it's always eight? Hmm. Okay. For this character. Right. For this man. Rubbish. Yeah. Yeah, this is dreadful. This is... Were you trying to do an AoE bad. hit there? Me? No, I was doing a armor piercing attack, which only pierces armor if it perfects. And I didn't perfect. Mm -hmm. Which is... Uh, not super fun. A tragic story. Ow. 39? Mm -hmm. That's quite a lot of damages. Should right. have there we go. Another 10 damage. Really making my contributions felt here, chaps. Uh, there's a party heal for us. All right, here we go. This is it. Hey. Uh, <laughs> drop Barely. that solid 10. I will... Hey, look, a 10 is the best multiple of 10 that's not 100. That's not at all true. On, on what scale? <laughs> yes, on it is. On scale of numbers that the most people know? No, just in terms of like the most pleasing numbers. 10? That's highly subjective. I would go for 20 next. I like 20 quite well. 30 even more? 40? Oh, don't even get me started. <laughs> no, surely. Like, does, does 10 not have like a special place? It's just like... 10 know. is overrated like yeah highly you're highly one used of the... way too much i'm going oh, back to the goodness. octal system i'm done with decimal look one I'm two three apologist. four five six seven eight back to one <laughs> <laughs> that's too mainstream for me i like binary in fact you know what i don't what? even like binary octal there's, there's is only less one mainstream number. than binary yeah, dude. Oh, for real though, right? Makes no sense. I just look at something, I I guess, and then I hold up my fingers. Mm-hmm. Usually, if it's over ten, I'm wrong. <laughs> 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 but with small, small, small groupings, it works very well. Oh no, I need fifteen potatoes. Guess I better take off my shoes. <laughs> I get in trouble at the supermarket. 
I also order my potatoes at, at the supermarket, I guess. Mm -hmm. Apparently. <laughs> That's where the best potatoes are all kept. Oh, okay. Where do you guys keep the good potatoes? I know you got them in back. <laughs> oh, These are just the dummy potatoes for the stupid idiots who walk in here and just like <sighs> buy them off the shelf. Give me your best potatoes. I come for your best potatoes. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna finish uh Black Witch. I, uh, yeah, I, th I think I'm gonna finish her off just uh purely out of my own choice and nothing to do with Rhapsody's instruction. <laughs> there we go. Look at this. Look at how much I've saved people. Or look at, actually, let me rephrase that. Look at how much Rhapsody's decision-making process has saved people. Hey, I wasn't gonna say it, but now that you said it, I heartily agree. All right. Just the other Black Witch, there we go. Mm. Oh. Easy. Easy. Oh, so close. That doesn't even matter. What are these Someone shackles? Nice little lightning on them. Uh, your it combat action is combat action. What? Not particularly effective. <laughs> Didn't do her no good. You got, uh, you've got two fast boys on your team, Rito, so... Uh, or fast-ish boys, I guess, on your team. I'm not particularly fast at the moment, actually, because of the bonnet. The bonnet actually slows me down by five. Oh, no. Mm. Uh, I've got to give you some oh. some of this stuff, Rhapsody. I've got a lot of God's beards. This seems very good for me. I don't even get to use it. Uh. This seems very good for me. <laughs> what am I doing? Am I collecting this? No, Just passing. Or what am I... Passing it to who? To me. <laughs> Who could possibly use that more than Orbital? Yeah, like crit chance. As, does that's that's effect a loot? That's true. It does yeah, have crit chance that's on true. it. I'm not dying hold in the on, next fight. On. I had to pop that beard. Hold on, Raps. Hold on, Rhapsody. I will hold on two seconds. Okay, uh give, 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 give. Alright, I just got it. Just got it. I knew you did. That's why that's why I did it. Definitely wasn't an accident. All right, great. Okay, what's the what's the play here, everyone? So the wisp is only really going to drain our focus, and we're almost already all out of focus. So probably worth targeting other things. All right, I'm gonna do the uh, shocky shock to Mr. Lichlord over there. Sounds good. That's uh, a complete failure. Might Abject get tried. Failure. Ah, <sighs> yay, yay! All right. Ooh. If I can uh, dodge redo him every time, then we'll be fine. Great news. All right. Here's a question for you boys. Well, there oh, goes no. your adventurous oh. cloak. Uh, that's a huge Ooh. loss, actually. Yep. It happens. Sure. Okay, Shall I here's... taunt or should I... Keep Kill. go smack Keep, him. Keep Kill. attacking. That's him. kind of what it is. I didn't feel like taunting, so I'm glad that's the oh. answer. That might work. Gonna die. Great. Oof. Bye, loser. Yeah. Okay. Attacking that death crab uh, and shocking it would be really good, preventing it from the possibility of stealing more items. Yeah, I feel. I feel that's a real big loss, actually. Ugh. That's okay. I can remove the protection from both of these characters at the same time. Oh, nice. <laughs> I, I, it's like one of those. You know, you ever see like a turtle run? Uh, no. Like a tortoise run, and it absolutely pelts it. Have you ever, have you ever seen that? No, I haven't. Oh. Why did it lose to the hair? If you can do that. They, they, they can actually go incredibly fast. It's a complete myth that they're slow. And I'm not even I'm not even winding you up here. Hmm. Um But it's totally wild. Nice. Um anyway, what I was meaning to say is that that crab attack looked rather like a a, a rapidly incoming uh, fast tortoise. 
Tis quite speedy. I'll admit that much. All right, here we go. Uh, uh, uh sure, I'll just. Mm, all right. This is gonna be a pain to kill. I can just feel it. Uh, yup. Unless you can, unless you can one shot it, Rito. No, no. Almost. Almost. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, oh great. <laughs> Literally <laughs> nothing that I can do here. What a fun collection of mechanics. <laughs> Again, nothing that I can do. Evasive, damage reflection, damage negation, 20 resistance, all the immunities. This guy was, uh, who they had fun with him. Mm hmm. And that's the only set of people that have ever had fun with this character. Is that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, thank goodness. We did it! We've triumphed over adversity. Okay, we're almost finished through the cave. Salty um, Jawbreaker. Who who wants this? Rapsy, probably best on you, I guess. Yeah, probably. Jawbreaker. Has anyone ever had a Jawbreaker? Hell yeah, my dude! Oh yeah. Really? Did you not have one when you were not watching cartoons? No, no, I was too busy not watching dark cartoons to partake in not having a jawbreaker. They were advertised <laughs> all over the cartoons. Oh. Yeah. You ever seen Ed, Ed, and there. Eddie? I have, actually. Hey, that, like, a lot of the plot lines of that revolve around <laughs> jawbreakers. 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 I'd also like to inform you that that is a cartoon. Look, I've never seen I'm... a cartoon <laughs> except for all the cartoons I've seen. Except for all the cartoons. Look, Ed, Ed and Eddie is my favorite live action show. What if... <laughs> did, you, did you think it was a live action show? Those are some weird looking actors. <laughs> Man, they love I mean... them jawbreakers. Okay, let me rephrase that. I, I, know what, I know what it is, but I've never like sat down and watched an episode. Is that... Does that clarify? I've never actively watched an episode of Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Okay. Would you oh, say I've... Simpsons is probably the cartoon you're most familiar with? Yeah, I've I've seen a I've seen a bit of The Simpsons. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you yeah. that so there's actually like a lot of the grounding formula for BoJack Horseman, like the the culture that it takes off in its format that you wouldn't actually recognize. Sorry, repeat all of that again, please. <laughs> I, I, I didn't catch any of that. I could so hear sorry. you not understanding. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so Bojack Horseman uses its format. That is to say the format of all of the different talking animals uh, in that cartoon and the way that it's presented as a cartoon uh, to yeah. uh, derive a lot of humor from. Um, are you just yeah. not familiar with the cultural touchstones that it's kind of appropriating there? I mean, I... Kind of, I guess. I mean, I don't get. I, I don't know if there's 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 perhaps some deeper meaning that I'm not getting, but uh, by definition, maybe? I guess you wouldn't. Yeah, probably not. I guess. He also um, still thinks it's live action. It oh is... yeah. No, it's not. <laughs> Will Arnett spends no, a really long time in that chair getting ready for BoJack Horseman. It is five and a half days of makeup to make him look cel shaded like that. <laughs> that's true i i have seen all bojack horseman that is a very good a very good uh television program extremely uh, good televisual program i agree uh so the answer is no i probably don't even understand half of that program because i'm just so uh un unschooled in the ways of cartoons oh good lord no no hannah barbera for you Oh, that I know about Hanna Barbera because I watched a video on it, but um, I don't actually know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know any Hanna Barbera cartoons. So you've watched more of a documentary about Hanna Barbera than you have Hanna Barbera cartoons. Yeah. Good lord. I think that says. I think that says a lot about me. You know, in terms. <laughs> it of the does. Fact that documentaries are more interesting than cartoons. Well, yes, but it says a lot about you if that is uh, that was your opinion from youth. 
<laughs> All right, so here we go. You ready for the voice? The voice that isn't going to sound like any other voice that you've heard me do for these characters before? Okay. Ember Demon, Ember Guardian. Save me! I'm a peasant trapped in this terrible form! <laughs> You'd be surprised how often that works. I guess you'll just have to die in combat then! <laughs> I'm scared. That was quite good. I enjoyed that. Yeah, thank you. I'm frightened. You did a good <laughs> job. I'm scared. You, you scared me more than this character does. Mm, that's the point. Were, uh, I was trying to get there. You were taking, you were taking references from a lot of uh, Simpsons characters and uh, <laughs> stuff like that. No, it's actually, Touchdown. it's it's like an old old like uh, comic voice reference uh, that has been appropriated for a bunch of different things, including uh, Simpsons references as well as uh, the Choose Goose in Adventure Time. I'm the Chills Goose. <laughs> That's what I, I was trying to figure out what I knew it from. Yeah. Shall Shall I taunt since this man is strong? Uh, didn't but Orbital just die. taunt? No, oh, did sorry, he? I didn't. I just armor up. You armor up. <laughs> oh, I ain't just, taunting. Let me just take care of myself. Just so you're aware, uh, taunting <laughs> increases your armor. Just so you're aware. I, I ain't taunting. <laughs> you You're getting hit. Get, get some get some use out of that armor up. Yeah, he's gonna hit me. Oh, and yep. look what look at he's gonna hit you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the intended target Rita. doesn't even get punished. Rita, that one that <laughs> Rita, that one is wholly on you, my friend. I don't no, think so. It's not. Bit, you should be I don't a little think bit more so. considerate of uh you should be a little bit more considerate next time. I feel like he understands my intent. Mm-hmm. That I meant for you to get hit. <laughs> I, do. I, I wanted. I was hoping fate would be on my side, but no. All right. Turns out that. Uh, Ooh. Turns out that taunting was absolutely meaningless, and I'm never ever gonna do it. Again. So. Uh, yeah, I was afraid that would happen. Yeah. All right. Well, should I taunt now? Uh, no. I'm just go for the kill. Pretty... Just go for the damage. Yeah. Um, no... Should I use yeah. my god's beard though? No, I'll, I'll party here when we get to my turn. If we are alive. Yeah, you have 42 HP. You'll be okay. You have 42 okay. HP. I had 40 dealt to me, and I have less armor than you. Oh, okay, okay. I didn't see what kind of damage he was doing. Um, Orbital, would you like to taunt? No? Okay. No, because taunt's not going to do anything. No, it does. It means that single hits like this. There we go. All good. I survived. So that's, you know, I blocked it. That we're is what's good. important. I'm, I'm we're all good. We're just kidding. angry. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're all alive. We're just mad. <laughs> I'm sprightly. I'm healthy. I'm happy. I'm glad one of us is. I still haven't lost my grand sanctum of oh, blood. Come on. Come on. I wanted that. There we go. There we go. Mm. <laughs> Look at that. There we go. Yeah. Is there I, any way I can I, just I, heal Rito? <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, you're popping a you're popping a scholar's wart. No, not uh, popping it. I just collected one. Oh, okay. Oh, with a gathering hat. Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. uh, does anyone want any scholar's warts? Because I've got uh, a couple. Um, I, will happily... I'm slightly behind, so I guess I'd, I'd take one. I, I'll give you a scholar's work. I am the person with the highest pipe level, so you should upgrade your pipe levels if you want to use other herbs and stuff like that. Because upgrading your pipe levels at this point is actually like relatively inexpensive. Yeah, okay. All right. Which I is will, to say I'll that you should to hold them. on to them until then. Yeah. All right. Cool. I guess, yeah, I guess we can try and upgrade a pipe level. I should have, I should have got it at the, the pipe lady. Yeah. Why didn't I do it then? There's only 15 as well. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's a demon ember crystal. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, great. One of those demon uh, crystals. Yeah. I have the Boeing Corporation's biggest, uh, Oh, hell yes. Ooh. 
It's a nice looking rope. Nice. Too. Big upgrade. Big. <laughs> big. <laughs> big coat. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, and that is probably going to take us to the end of the episode, Orbital. Yeah, that's 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 a perfect time to end. Um, ladies and gents, thanks very much for watching. Uh, I've been Orbital Potato. I've been joined by uh, Rito of Retromation and Rhapsody of Rhapsody Plays. Um, this has been For the King. Uh, thank you very much for watching. And we will see you next time. Bye. Bye-bye. Adios.